The community continues to rally around Carn City High School quarterback Mason Martin after he was rushed to the hospital last Friday night. Messages of hope and strength are all over the Butler County community. And as Chris Hoffman reports, they all share one simple and heartfelt notion. Signs like this outside of Carn City High School are all around the area as people continue to rally and support the family of Mason Martin. One of the definitions for strong includes not easily affected by hardship. That definition is on display in windows and signs all over the Carn City area. Oh, everybody's so sad about it. You know, it's just a tragedy, you know, that happened there. Friday night's high school football game changed the community in an instant. Martin went down after a play and had to be life flight to UPMC Presbyterian Hospital with a brain bleed and a collapsed lung. It was an eerie feeling and it was something nobody's ever seen around here. Mason's mother says there has been little change over the past 48 hours since she gave an update on Monday. The family has called for prayers and continued support. The community has answered. I think our community has uh, uh, been outstanding in, in regards to doing what we can do and that's pray hard and, and, and do whatever we can do to make this community feel better. The family's going through a lot and I think they need everybody's prayers. For students, this has been a challenge. Even district employees are having a hard time because in an area where everyone knows each other, one family's pain is felt by everyone. I just hope everybody's well and they get through it there uh, and pray for them there. But people who know the Martin family already know they embody the definition of strong. They now have an entire community in their corner. They are so strong and they've helped us. They are the strength behind our community right now. If you would like to send your messages of hope and support to the Martin family, we have how on our website and app. In Carn City, Butler County, Chris Hoffman, KDKA TV News.